be nice to think that corporate boards know how to do the right thing. In the case of electronics giant Best Buy, chairman of the company, Richard Schultz, has resigned after the board determined that he misled the board after learning months ago that former CEO Brian Dunn was having an affair with a subordinate roughly half his age. Then over at Yahoo, you have CEO Scott Thompson resigning after the board accepted the fact that, well, it looks like he lied on his resume to get the job. In both cases, this looks like a triumph of corporate ethics. But is it really? Well, I'm not so sure. Schultz's case went on for months. The board had to dither a little bit. They had to put together a committee. They had to come up with a report. And then in Yahoo's case, well, it seems pretty clear the board was hoping this whole thing would blow over, calling it an inadvertent mistake at one point. When it became clear it wasn't going to blow over, well, that's when the board decided to act. I think it's great when corporate leadership can reach the right decision but I think it would be all the more legitimate and sincere and believable if these guys could do it in a timely fashion. I'm David Lazarus. See you in the business section.